Hey, how's it going? I got 16 minutes of space left on my handy cam here, and I decided to, so I've been doing one video after another. I just got done messing with a corner rounder that I was testing out, and now I'm going to, I have this case. This case is beautiful. I think I got it a couple of weeks ago. It's got a pocket. It has a little Velcro. I don't know what you would put in there without it falling out because I would think the Velcro would have to go all the way across. Anyway, what I want to do with this one is I want to use this for a travel arts and crafts case to put a variety of colored pencils and uh, markers, alcohol ink markers, acrylic paint markers, regular fine line markers, maybe some Sharpie markers in it. I haven't really given this much thought. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight areas that have slots. And these, I have a, another one just like this, but it's a different design. It has cats on the other side. Actually, I have it. Have it right here at my feet. This is filled with watercolor markers and pencils and water brush pens. So that's another thing that I want to put in here, some water brush pens, and then also, you know, uh, oh, I hate that. <laughs> I hate it. Uh, water brush pens, watercolor pencils, watercolor markers, uh, acrylic paint markers, alcohol ink markers, I'm trying to think what else, now. and Sharpie markers, I think. Well, alcohol ink, Sharpie markers are alcohol ink markers. I didn't know that, but that's what they are. So, maybe I won't do the Sharpie markers. Okay. I, and, uh, based on the advice from Kelly Donovan, from her YouTube channel, Kelly Donovan Knitting and Things, all I need are... <laughs> Woo, that's a lot of colored pencils. So I was talking about the straps here. I wasn't really talking about the straps. I kind of got a uh, jump ship on that. I'm sorry. <laughs> but uh, these straps are very wide. And I can get four, look at that, four colored pencils per strap. I could probably get five in there since they're out like this. But they don't all go like that. Like this, the N ones seem to be wider than the in, inside inner ones here. And I can get here, uh, I don't know why these are upside down, but they are. I can get, these are watercolor, Artessa watercolor brush pens. And I can get two of these in each uh, little strap here. So, now I'm just turning these around because they're bugging me. And I should put them alternate them or something. They all have to lie flat anyway, so it doesn't really matter if it's upside down or right side up. <laughs> but for me, it's just it's getting on my nerves. Oh no, look at all of them upside down. And then I have water brush pens here. Um, the ones, I have other ones that go here. And I can get two per two, four, six, like that. Uh, in there, so they are nice and wide. These straps are nice and wide. So, these are Hero watercolor pencils, and these are Artessa watercolor pencils. All right, and these are Windsor and Newton watercolor markers as well. And I was wondering too, like this in this pouch. There's, um, this is a holder for the Hero, well, for the watercolor pencils. And then this has a sharpener and an eraser and then a little, uh, eraser on those long, elongated. <laughs> so that's, I put that, that was an incense, had incense in it. So I thought, hey, I can use that as a pouch to hold some tools, you know, necessary for watercolor pencil tools. 
So this is this supply. I have another case where I keep my, a, a much bigger case, not by the same company here, where I keep my um, acrylic paint markers and alcohol ink markers. And then the fine liner pens, because I have both Artessa and I have Sharpie fine line pens. And what did I do with those? So, Kelly Donovan says, you need white, black, brown, try this one, white, black, brown, and then the colors of the rainbow, purple, so I'm telling you, this is, I'm going to run out of space on my card before I... <laughs> I've discovered that it's easier to look at the tip for the color than the barrel because the tip shows a different color than the barrel. Hold on, where's that purple? Blue, purple, so red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple. I'm not going to select indigo. And I just want a basic blue. I think it's that one. Green. Basic green. All right. Yellow. I'm going to select this yellow. Orange. Orange. That's probably vermilion orange. Vermilion red, which is really orange. Red. There you go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine colors. That's all you need. That's what I'm still. So, but what I want to do, of course, is I want to um, take both the Hero ones and the Artessa pencils with me because... Um, even though I'm selecting basically the same colors or similar colors, uh, they do have different shades. So I have white, and I think on these, like I have charcoal and noir. <laughs> I'll take the noir, which is black. Okay, gray has, there are four different grays. Okay, I'm not taking gray, right? Right? Chocolate brown. Uh, espresso. Cocoa. What's the difference between chocolate and cocoa? There is apparently a difference. So I'll take espresso. There is also... Sienna Brown, Burnt Ochre, let's take Espresso, Espresso, I don't really need brown because green and red make brown, okay, okay, a purple, purple Iris, oh, uh, what's that purple? Amethyst, which is my birthstone color. I'll take that one. Uh, blue. Ult Ultramarine. Looks, looks a lot like blue. Blueberry. Let's take Ultramarine. Why be normal? Take a different shade of the blues and greens and whatnot. Turquoise, uh, emerald, moving right along, then a brighter yellow, yellow sapphire, and then orange, actual orange, labeled orange. 
Carmine, Carmine or Carmine Red? I want to say Carmine. What is going on? Oh, cinnamon. Okay, so those are the colored pencils. These are watercolor pencils, and I do have regular colored pencils, and I'm running down to six minutes of space left on my handy cam. Okay, um... Then the Windsor and Newton ones, I only have uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 12 of those, so I might take all of those with me. And um, it, it just has like two yellows and two, two blues, a dark and a light, and then a dark and a light, both dark and a light. So I'll probably take all those with me. And um, as far as the watercolor pencils go, I will be doing red, orange, lemon yellow, these upside down ones, what does that say, light green, green, Royal blue. Why is that one there? Fair skin. <laughs> I can't read. Tawny. Or brown tawny. Uh, dolphin gray. No. I'm not taking gray. I might need to take... For markers, I might have to take a gray. All right, we'll take a gray. Purple. Okay. Those. All right. Ta -da! Four minutes. Oh my goodness. I have to go. So I'm going to do the spinner because I'm running out of space here. Ooh, I like that one. Have a salubrious day. <laughs> Bye.